You know what I did instead? I didn't back down. I seeked God's face first. I said, God, I don't know what you're doing in my life. I don't know why this turmoil is happening. I don't know what the devil's trying to do to me. But I know that your plan, your purpose for my life is bigger, it's deeper. I'm an original. I know it's better what you have planned for me on the other side. How fast can you turn over your life to him? When things go by, the turmoil you're going to face won't stop. The devil doesn't stop. The devil never stops coming after you. That's what I'll tell you. It, it's deceitful. He's a liar. He comes in so many shapes and forms. But God's blood, Jesus' blood, will wash over that. It will wash over that like this. And you got to believe that on the other side of that turmoil is his plan and his purpose for your life. Sometimes the devil is going to come in, in these different ways. It might be little things. It might be big things. It might be what somebody says to you, how they make you feel. Maybe you were bullied. Maybe they're push, pushing your buttons. Maybe it's your family at home. I don't know. He's going to pry. He's going to lie to you. He's going to want you to believe the things that aren't true. In those moments where I'm just at my house ready to come here, I got this turmoil face in my life and I'm trying to pour into you. In that time, am I going to question God's love for me? Am I going to start to believe these lies in my head? You're not worthy, Lance. Nobody wants to work with you. Your mission's not important. You're not good enough. You'll never go to the next level. Why would you try hard? Why would you keep going? Raise your hand if you've ever heard a thought like that. Inside your, inside your head. How about this one? What I'm doing doesn't matter. It's up there. It's happening right now. I know it is because I've been there. I was there 10 minutes ago. I was just there. And I don't want you to back down because without that moment, I wouldn't be able to talk about it right now. I wouldn't even be able to take what he was doing in me for you. This is for you. Those thoughts that you're having, everybody has them. How quickly can you turn turmoil to Christ? How quickly, when you don't get the result that the coach wants and he gets into you, how quickly can you say, Lord, I know what you're doing is important. Help me to be better. Help me to see this situation differently.